Hey YouTube, uh, Tyler J six six one six here. I'm gonna be showing you guys a really cool video on how to make your own theme within your iPhone or iPod. This is an iPhone first generation or second generation, but it should work with any other device. So wait one sec. Okay. So now this one I did not. This one is was my example that I made. I'll show you guys again. So, what you're going to want to do is uh, download an app from Cydia called iFile. I'll put that in the description. So, there it is iFile. And uh, what you're going to want to do is, well, if, like, you should start at the beginning uh, if you just download this for the first time. So you're at the slash, and then you go down to the bottom at var. Okay? So then, once you're in var, go to stash, and then themes. Alright, so what you can do now is, you can go up to the top, edit, and down there, add. And then, we will make, uh, we'll name this one, I don't know. Okay, cool theme. So, but then once you name it, you're going to want to change the type from regular file to directory. Okay? And then you want to hit create. So now, uh, sorry about that. You should, you can look for it. It should be right there. Cool theme. You're going to want to go in cool theme, edit, again, uh, edit. And then add right there. And you're gonna want to you're gonna want to name it oh, name it icons. Capital I. V. Icons. Change the type from regular file to directory. And then you want to hit create. So there that is. And then you're gonna want to go into icons, and then you, now you can start messing around. So let's just find some a fun theme to use. I really like Alix. Uh, the cool theme. Check it out. So we'll go into the icons, and we'll find some icons to show you guys what it looks like. And I'll get in there. So edit up at the top. All right. Losing control of my camera. All right. I'm gonna check App Store and I'm gonna check a few more of them. Dtunes. Alright, so that I chose Dtunes, Facebook, and uh, or some other one. I don't know. But once you have them checked like that, you're gonna wanna go down to right there and hit copy slash link. Okay? Okay. Copy slash link. And then you're done with that. So once you did that, you're gonna want to go back to your theme. Go into icons, edit, and add it there. Now there's App Store, Dtunes, or Facebook. And now we're gonna find some other ones to add in there. Show you that uh, I'm making this for the first time. So wait, we're gonna go actually into a tougher class. We will put in Cydia. Uh, iPod and iTunes. Okay. So copy. Done. Go back to your theme again. Okay, so really are right there. Mm. Done. Okay, so now if now this is how you can go about doing wallpaper, okay? So let's say you like a touch of class wallpaper a lot. There that is right there. 
I do like that a lot, but let's say you don't like that, you want your user wallpaper to be on, you can do this. If you still have user wallpaper theme right there, what that is is your lock screen will become your wallpaper right behind your icons. So go into uh, that wallpaper.jpc or g, I can't really tell what this font, but anyway, it's a highlighted blue one, okay? So that one's a special one, so click on it. Go down there. Copy link. Okay. Done. But remember, like I said, you don't have to do user wallpaper. You can do GeoZ Pro or you can do any other theme you have as a wallpaper to it. Okay. Then you go back into your theme. And then you edit. And you add right into it. You don't add into a folder. You add it right into the folder. That probably sounded stupid, alright. So as you can see, this icon from this wallpaper dot, dot, dot jpc, sorry, or jpeg, yeah. And then you're good right there. And then you're ready to see what your theme looks like. So you can just go on Twinkerboard. So there it is, cool theme. Now I did just make this for the first time, so. Yeah, I did not make this before video. Okay. So as you can see, custom iPod one. Dtunes and Facebook have one. Uh, yeah, so Cydia, iTunes, I believe we did those ones. And we did App Store, Facebook, and Dtunes and stuff and iPod. And there's the user wallpaper right there. So that has been my video on how to make your own theme within your iPhone or iPod Touch. If you like this video, please comment, rate, subscribe, and peace out.